We're continuing to monitor the eruption of Mauna Loa and potential impacts to health, weather and traffic. The eruption is the reason a number of people are now heading to the Big Island, hoping to catch a glimpse of the spectacle that could be a once in a lifetime experience. We have live team coverage tonight. KITV4 Chief Meteorologist Pete Caggiano has the latest of weather conditions around Mauna Loa, as well as the wet weather across the state. And we begin with KITV4's Ali Ducolo, who has been covering the eruption on the Big Island since yesterday. With the volcano erupting, a surge of onlookers has created a risk to drivers in the area. Ah. Uh -uh. Yeah, well, Rick, just take a look at it. What a marvel it is. This is what people are paying to come here and enjoy. Look at it. Lava fountaining out of the top of Mauna Kea, streaming down its slopes. Now, what you can't see around here is a ton of cars sort of parked along the Daniel K. Inouye Highway here. Many of them moments ago were told to leave before they would get sighted. Now, of course, that's because transportation officials say it is a safety hazard. We did, however, speak with some onlookers who flew in just to catch the eruption. I didn't know that I was going to come to Big Island until two days ago. I came to visit my dad in Oahu and he told us we had 6 a.m. flights here and here we are. We're just going to visit for the next three days and um, three days ago I was just joking around with my girl and she's like it'd be funny if the volcano erupted right and uh, yeah here we are. <laughs> it's an incredible first experience to come to the Big Island and to get to see lava live. Again, officials with the Department of Transportation are urging the public not to park along the highway and they will be enforcing the no parking zones between mile markers 16 and 31. That's because this is a high speed route with some sections posted at 60 miles per hour and the road wasn't meant to accommodate a high volume of cars on its shoulders or pedestrians walking in the road, roadway. DOT is also reminding drivers shoulders are a safety feature for cars in trouble, not sightseeing. Though onlookers are encouraged to park in designated parking areas for a safer option. And of course, we will bring the very latest on this eruption from right here on Hawaii Island. But for now, reporting live, Ali Iduklo, KITV4 Island News.